Good morning, everybody. It's Midnight and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of Fire Emblem Awakening. In the last episode, we got two new powerful allies, Gregor and Noe, to join the group. In this episode, we could head to the Plegia Castle Courtyard, but we got some shops here for us. Aw, oh, come on. So, we have a special visitor, but there's an enemy in the way, so we can't actually go to this shop. We can't get a steel axe or a steel bow. This would be cool. Energy drops. Still don't really know what those do. I don't want to challenge the opponent, but unfortunately, that's all you can do. Uh, it would be good for getting experience. I'm not going to be spending this episode just doing that, though. We do get new supports for Noe and Gregor. And that's about it, though. Hmm. I think I'm going to pass on this. Maybe the enemy will disappear over time, and then I could just go to the shop, but then Anna might disappear as well. Uh, I don't know. For now, though, I'm just going to give Lon Ku that second, or not the second seal, going to give him the killing edge that we got in the last episode immediately. And then I would like to use our first master seal, actually. And I'm going to give it to our good old buddy Krom, the leader of the bunch. You know him well. So, I thought about what I wanted to do with Krom, if I wanted to change his class altogether, or just keep him as is. And for the main character, I think I would rather keep him as is, just because I, if my Robin design was any indication, I like to keep things plain and simple, basically. So, we are going to take that, and we are going to use it on Krom. This will upgrade Krom to a great lord, a seasoned leader of royal blood, wield swords and lances. Let's do it. Congratulations, your Krom evolved into Krom! Let's see what I'm capable of now. As you can see, these seals are very worth your time, and now Krom can use lances! And he... Oh hey, he already has a lance in his inventory, are you so? That's very good, but he can't use this specific one? I don't get it? Okay, well, we'll see, but whatever. Now that's done though, before we get head into battle, let's go ahead and see our support with our new characters, Noe and Gregor. Gramps. Gramps? What is this Gramps? If Gregor is Gramps, then little girl is great, 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 great granny. So you know how old I am, huh? Weird. Most people can't stop talking about how young I look. Nonsense. Is just how you say flatulence? No, wait. Flippery? Flatness? Gregor does not remember. Is, is that word where people say lies to make other person feel better? No idea what you're talking about. Anyway, I have something to ask you. If you want to borrow money, answer is no. Gregor is poor like beggar. We'll be fine. Yeah, I know that. That's why I want to give you something. Huh? You give Gregor shiny gold coin? Huh? No, Krom doesn't let me have money. I always end up losing it. You've been with us for like five minutes, and how much money have you lost already? Jeez. <sighs> Agreed. Gregor too is soon trusting senile squirrel with life savings. Hey, for your information, I happen to be quite smart. So I just don't care about money, is all. Us mannequins don't use it much. <laughs> uh, it's very good. Money is root of evil. So then what do you give Gregor? Listen. I needed you a big woolly sweater. See? It's got shoulder pads built in. Good grieving. Now this looks like grab clothing. Also, Gregor is no good in sweater. It's too hot, yes? <laughs> yeah, but this one is really light. It really breathes. I lined it with Manichetti scales. Hmm, scales of Manichetti. Gregor is stunned. How are you finding such priceless artifacts? See, I thought you'd be surprised. I just had some lying around, so don't worry about it. Many thanks. Then Gregor accepts the wonderful gift with much gratitude. Okay. Glad you like it. Now we and Gregor attain support level C. That was really cute. Glad to see that they made amends after what happened last episode. It was all just a big misunderstanding, so there's nothing really too terrible to begin with. But yeah, now that we're finally done, it's finally time to head to Plesia Castle. Let's hope that we made it in time and can make a difference. <sighs> 
So, Captain, let me be certain I understand your report. Not only did you not confirm that the Leolysian party carries the Fire Emblem, but you can't be certain Prince Krom is even among them? Is that the gist of it? Yes, my lady. The air was thick with sand. Even their number was, diff was difficult to ascertain. Perhaps if you had gotten closer, Captain. Here, let me show you. No! I'm sorry! I... <sighs> Apology accepted. Do not try to kill all the soldiers, my dear. We'll need a few for the welcoming party. The Elysians will be here soon. Krom and the Emblem are among them, I'm sure. That bleeding heart prince will never put good sense before his sister. And when they arrive... Let's destroy them. It will be a massacre worthy of their legendary father. Sire. The exile is to be executed at the castle on the tomorrow. I hear it from the king's own lips, sir. Right. This is it, then. Exactly as you predicted, Robin. So far, yes, but tomorrow will be the true test. Please. Chin up there, show some confidence. It's your thinking that's got us this far. The plan is risky, but only as much as called for. It's all right. We'll find a way to see it through. Robin, don't you worry. This time tomorrow, we'll be swapping stories with them on the ride home. I hope you're right. Master Grima, Exalt Emeryin is to be put to death on the morrow. Events will soon be back on course. <laughs> yes, I should never have doubted the truth in your words. The yoke of destiny cannot be cast off. Even as they resist, they write your future with them. Every step, oh great one. Huh? Robin? Hey Robin, what's wrong? Was it a nightmare? Oh. Is... That what it was? Yes, it must have been. I'm sorry. What brings you here, Lissa? Was there something you needed? <clears throat> Frederick says it's time to march. And we can't start the plan without our master tactician. Good people, warriors of Plesia, welcome, welcome one and all. Your anticipation electrifies the air. We all remember the crimes of Ulysses. Would you have their witch queen answer for them? Here? Today? Now? Yes! Finally, we will have justice. Executioner, if you would be so kind. Flavia! I've me. got him! Let's go. Everyone, now! It's time to save her. What do we gotta do? We gotta form together a stellar team to pull off this mission. Main four, of course. Um... This is still in the sand, so 
a cavalry unit unit will not be very pleasurable for this mission. I think who we have right now is as good as we're gonna get. All right, switch people around a bit to make it a bit easier for us, but it's time to pull off the most important mission of our lives. Let's stop this war and save our queen. Listen to me. Take out all the soldiers first. We'll deal with the Mad King later. Huh. Oh, will you now? Bwaha! We've been expecting you, little prince. Men, kill him. Kill his sister. Kill his troops and his friends and anyone else you find. Kill them all! Route the enemy. We have one boss over here. It's a simple general, not even the head honcho. <sighs> We're just gonna have to run with it. So, let's start with pairing people up with the flyers. We could get them further into the battlefield. Krom, I want you to be. I think Krom and Robin should be paired up for this. Unfortunately, Robin doesn't count as an actual uh, mage, so she won't get the benefit of moving super quickly through this place, but we'll just have to work with it. Lissa, go with Frederick. Uh, Gaius, uh, he's in kind of a crummy spot. I'm gonna put Pain. I'm gonna put Noe with Pain. And we're going to do that. Long coup. You want to wait for Gaius, I guess? I don't really have any other choice. Get these guys over here. Cordelia, you could handle yourself. Wait, you could attack from the side. Oh, yeah, she has a javelin, so she could attack from the side. It's not as powerful, but it's something. Though this will change her weapon to a javelin, like her equipped weapon, so that might not be good during the counter-attacking phase. We'll see. Also 69. But this is not a time for 69. It's way too important of a mission for that. Uh, it's something, I guess. You gotta take what little you could get. Let's go over here. Uh, Samia. I'm gonna switch to Gregor just to be a meat shield. And I guess that's it for now. So we're to kill or die here, simply because the king demands it? <sighs> what do I care, these Yalissians? We're given no reasons to fight, only orders. What's the point? Besides, I've always been quite good at choosing who to hate on my own. Seems like someone's having second thoughts about which side to be on. If we could somehow get Krom over there within an ample amount of time, we might be able to get her to join us. Oh, this guy's at 1 HP. God darn it. I might need to switch the teams up a bit. I kind of forgot that Krom was uh, super necessary in this one. If uh, Sort of like with Gaius. If he ends up, or if she get, ends up getting attacked by one of our other allies during a counterattack and she gets killed in the process, she is no longer recruitable. So we need to have Krom go over there and talk to her. It's the only way we could get her to join us. Okay, that's kind of unfortunate. And hey, there's a green ally over there. Someone with a killer axe. Uh, we can't control that one, unfortunately, but they seem to be on our side. It's good for a distraction, but uh, it's also good for getting rid of some of these guys. Oh, jeez, that was a lot of sinking damage. Yeah, but she's using the javelin. Is he even going to kill him? No, six damage. Oh, uh, that was a, probably a really bad move to switch her item to her weapon to the javelin. Oh, that's going to kill her. We lost one of our flyers. That is horrible. Oh no, not on our first turn. Now we really need new allies more than ever. Exalt Emerian! No! God, speed me to her side! That's a powerful ally. I don't think we need to talk to them, but I think Krom... I think if you do talk to them, you get control over them, but they're still going to be fighting for us at this point in time, so that's good. God darn it. I did not want Cordelia to die this second early. Uh, Longku's kind of useless right now. He shouldn't be, though. I'm messing, up this, I'm messing this up so horribly. Uh, I'm going to separate. I need, I need these guys to be... With different groups, basically. Uh, Krom, get rid of this guy, I guess. Can't really separate these guys right now. I probably could have switched it off to a different person, but 
Oh, I'm messing everything up. 87 damage, though, is nothing to sneeze at, so Krom will at least not be in any danger if he goes on ahead. Uh, Pain, we are going to... Pain's level 10. Noe, uh, I just need to get her stronger, so only one way to do that, I guess, and that is by experience. Teaming up the two monsters together. Okay, she at least gets a level up from that. Yeah, don't even think of messing with Noe. Noe's so buff. 2 OP, please nerf. Uh, Rickon. Uh, so I don't want to give Rickon the experience. That's another problem. It's like being stingy about who to give the experience to. I'll get rid of you. Just Rickon, but Samia so now uh, grows a relationship with him. That's good. Okay, and let's see if he survives this. Look at the counterattack. Okay, we got no more enemies on our side. Basically, we just need to get to the stinking allies. See, I can hold my own. This is such a stressful situation. I don't even really know what to say right now. Oh wait, there was one more. God darn! I didn't even see him. Oh, great! What he said. Uh, losing more and more allies, this isn't good. That person over there, Libra. At least they can hold their own pretty okay. Uh, we don't like having them- oh wait, I was pressing up by accident. You can change it to like a first person view and stuff like that, it's really weird. You can do all the different things. Uh, I like the auto one, it's just like it chooses the good one. The good camera angle. Sorry about that though. Uh, he's also a healer though, so that's good. Where is that darn Wyvern Brigade? Hurry! Close off their escape! What do I want to do now? Transfer. I could transfer. Okay, good. Oh, wait, I don't want to transfer Robin! God darn it, no! Uh, uh. Oh, that made me mad. Oh, jeez. Fine, just attack him. I did not want to transfer Robin over to Sumia. I was trying to. Uh, just make so many stupid mistakes. Oh, I don't know why I did this the way I did. Uh, Gregor's got nobody. I just don't want to get too close with other allies because this person might start attacking. I guess this is okay. Mm. This is an archer, though. Hmm. Guess we'll go right here. Sumia. So get rid of this guy, I guess. We'll go for it. I know I wanted to get Krom in with her, but I can't do that right now. And can't pair him up with Rickon because he's dead. This is not looking good. We could just get rid of the guys on this side. We could take a minute to like just relax a bit. Even though it doesn't really seem like... Oh, her Iron Lance broke. Are you kidding me? Okay. I regret everything. Who has a Lance? Ephirim's Lance. How, if only they were partnered up right now. God darn it. Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. He has a Steel Lance. I need to get Lanku over to Sumia. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Hopefully this guy will be able to take them out. Uh, Gregor's on his own. Not good. And, oh man, you might actually go down in this one. Oh, great. Bad. It's very bad. Oh my god, I'm just messing up horribly this stinking fight. Like, all fights to mess up in, this is not one that it should be happening in. Okay, no, he's so stinking frail. I don't remember her being this frail. Ally phase, what do you got for us? Oh, he's coming to protect us, that's nice. I appreciate it, friend. You also make it a bit easier for Krom to get over to us. Or to you, rather. Krom, what do I even want to do with you? Transfer. No, switch. Transfer. Sumia to Krom. Good. I don't know, that's basically all I, I could have done. Uh, Krom, let's see if you can take out those guys. Lanku. Lanku or Gaius? 
Guys, seven. Uncle's nine. And we'll do Gaius. Okay. Oh, thank you for dodging. I was kind of worried going into that because it would have taken half his HP. Uh, Sumia has... Oh, no. Sumia doesn't have a weapon. Okay, I switched over to Krom, though, so it's fine for now. I was not expecting you guys to be so slow. Let's switch to Lissa. Maybe she'll be faster. Uh, Get whatever this is. Probably not a good time for it, but whatever. I practiced my dragon. Rawr! Hopefully he'll scare away some more baddies now. Weapon proficiency improves. You got dragon stone as a weapon. Uh, Noe or Pain run out of their sinking weapon juice, then that's going to be really bad. Thankfully, they got like a ton of juice in it, so it's fine for now. Okay. Oh, you're going to talk to us. Thank you. You there. Who are you? Why do you fight alone? Good heavens. You're Prince Krom, brother to her grace, the Exalt. What? You know me? Yes. Know you? Of course, sire. All the Elysian clergy do. I must thank the gods for uniting us. Oh, dearest and most heavenly fa- With all respect, now is not the time for prayer. It's action that's called for. Uh, too true. We hurried here to help as soon as the word came of the execution. We? Then there are more of you? Alas, there were. I lost many brave comrades along the way. In truth, I was starting to doubt the purpose of my struggle. But no longer. Pray, sire, let my axe serve you and your party. Yes. Your love for my sister is clear. I would be honored but to be joined by such a formidable woman of the cloth. Um, man, sire. Man of the cloth. Hmm? You're a... You're not a woman? Beg pardon. No, sire. Women are clerics. I am a priest. Well, technically a war monk, if you care to split hairs. Forgive me. Oh, yes. Well, I, I didn't mean to imply. Well, this is rather awkward. No. It's all right, sire. You realize your mistake quickly enough. It could have become much more awkward. <laughs> much more. Right, let's stop there. Okay, at least we can have a little bit of... Co okay, comedy's over. I was like, oh, at least we get to have a little fun, bit of fun time during this. But then, four... So many reinforcements. He, he warned us about it, though. But now we, get in, we are now in control of Libra, which is incredibly helpful. Libra is an incredibly powerful ally, as we saw. He's an axe user. Robin, let's go parry up with him for now. Go over here. We can already move him so much further. He can also heal, so we got another healer as well. Uh, I'm going to switch over to Robin. Have her take out this guy. Now, we need to be a bit more cautious now because uh, Libra was uh, kind enough to actually talk to Krom and not the other way around, so I was able to get him as an ally rather quickly. However, this character will not be the same, so we need to keep our distance, unfortunately. I hate doing it like that, but we need to just uh, inch our way towards uh, this character without, like, setting them off. If they can make their way over here just a little bit, and then we could talk. I don't know. We'll see. Hmm. These guys. Oh, thank God you can move. Uh, Lissa is really good for this area. In terms of just moving, at least. Uh, Gaius misses, he dies. Uh, let's go for it, I guess. Thankfully, he didn't miss. Gets a level up. Sweet. Okay. It's a bit easier, but now we got these guys on our tail. These guys we still have to deal with. This isn't going to be easy. I'm going to keep Noe in here still. Just so she could heal some more. Just move her one square, though. Okay. This guy's coming after us. They're going to start moving. So hopefully that other person will get a bit closer. Make this a little bit easier for me. They're moving. Oh, no. They're flyers. They're all flyers. Uh, unfortunately, the only thing I could do is... I have to switch to Sumia and get her distance, basically get her movement speed. Wait. Oh, she doesn't have a weapon. Mm. Longku, where are you? Let's switch. And let's see. I need to trade with... Oh, God. This is... Oh, this is horrible. Could Krom trade with... 
he could trade with Sumia. Okay, good to know. So I need to trade with... Oh, I could just trade with Sumia right here. Okay, cool. I didn't think I could. Trade with Sumia. Give her... Oh, no, I just switched to Longku. This is so stinking difficult. Uh... Okay, switch to Longku. Trade with Sumia. She can't use this. Wait, no, hold on. She could use the ceiling. Okay, good. Jesus. Okay, now Longku's stuck here, so get rid of this guy. Okay, oh, I wish you would have been able to take him out one hit. Really wanted you to take him out one hit. Don't like Longku taking that much damage. He's way too valuable of an ally. Uh, phooey. I don't want to get any closer. How far could she get? Yeah, I can't get any closer without risking it. Switch to Sumia. Hope she doesn't die during the counterattack. At least we can take out the archer. That's our biggest concern. She needed that steel lance, though. Alright. I've got a killer bow. Who uses bows besides... I think Vir Is Viren the only one? It's, a, it's in the Killer series, so I like it. Uh, maybe we'll have to get Viron back on the team later in the future when we get more... It's just a matter of like not having enough allies or not having enough room to mess around with. Uh, Samia's... Uh, Lanku needs more HP, though. I don't want... I don't want him in the, her in the front. Heal Lanku. Okay, that was really needed. Uh, he could attack Alyssa, though. Alyssa might die, actually. Uh, phooey. Uh, Libra was moving incredibly quickly before, though. Boost and allies resistance up. Oh, that's really cool. And everyone's right here, so why, why the... Oh, it only works on one character. I thought it would use do it on everyone. That would be way too powerful, though. Mend, knowing... Eh, sure, why not? That's 30 HP. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have used that. Do this person cannot go quite yet? Let's go over here. Okay, we have no need to transform. So we're just like so on edge. I don't really have much to say. I'm just like incredibly intense. This battle started out really poorly, but we're picking it up. We're picking up the pace, picking up the slack. Now we got a wyvern rider. Nothing a manichetti can't handle, I would think. 9 HP. 15. No, that's it. Okay. These guys are still coming. We just need to get the boss out, I think. But we might need to get rid of all of them. And we can make it over to her. Thank God. Switch to Krom. Talk to her. You there. Are you with the Plesians? You seem reluctant to fight. Maybe. Death comes for all of us eventually. Why invite it early? Fighting for a cause I don't believe in. What? So, I should take that as a no, or... Let's just say I'm keeping my options open. I mean, long live the king and all, but I'd like to keep living as well. And I have a bit of rebellious streaks, I'm afraid. A dark side. Good. Then perhaps you would rebel now and fight for our cause? What? You would trust me? What if this is all just a ploy to plunge a dagger in your back? My sister, the Exalt. I think she would trust you, and I'm trying to learn from her. Besides, I already need to watch my back, whether you're with us or not. Interesting. Well, that's odd. Usually when I bring up the backstabbing bit, the discussion is over. Alright then, consider me your new ally. For now. Tharja is awesome. And I know her official pronunciation is Tharja! But I ain't one to roll with that, so I'm not even gonna bother. Everyone pronounced it Tharja before that sinking Nintendo Direct, so I'm gonna keep with that pronunciation. Tharja is a dark mage. She has electricity and dark magic at her disposal. She is ridiculously overpowered and one of the best characters in the game, one of the most beloved characters in the game. We have another powerful ally here to help us win this war. She doesn't even need someone on her side to get this done. Oh my god, I'm like so single. Word. First time playing this, I actually did not get Tharja because she ended up getting killed and I immediately regretted it. 
Uh, I did reset though, so I did have her with my first playthrough. This is like first time I did this mission, I didn't get her and it was really crummy. Let's go. go ahead and have Libra take out this character. Very, very awesome. Oh, but now these guys are all caught up to us, but no one's on this side. It's just the reinforcements we have to deal with now. Uh, we could just ward him off, I guess. No, we will go down to 1 HP if she doesn't take him out in one hit. Please take him out in one hit, Noe. I really need it. Thank you. Get another level up in the process. She has magic really? Okay, cool. I feel like I could take on a whole army. It's kind of weird to have a stat star of zero and then it gets one. Usually when zero is like, you'll never get it increased. Uh, Longku, what do I want you to do? Gaius is not in a good position to fight these guys, so I guess we'll have him fight this dude. Can you get a critical for me? I really appreciate it. Yes! Thank you. Okay, gets rid of him. Level up for him. Longku's killing edge is very close to breaking, though. He's at level 10, though, so we could upgrade him. Not really sure what I want to upgrade him to, though, so I'll have to think about that. Uh, switch to Frederick. Uh, keep more HP, I guess. Go and do that. No damage, because Frederick is amazing. Get that experience. And panic mode. Of course, they're going for long coup. Oh god, half his HP. Can you get rid of him? No. Long Ku's actually gonna go down if he doesn't dodge. Oh, Vantage! Hello! He gets to attack before the guy even counters, attacks us. Okay, and we miss. Okay, awesome. But his killing edge broke. Oh uh, no! Sinking hand axe, he's throwing it from afar. Thank you for missing. Thank you, thank you, thank you for missing. Okay, what do I want to do now is the question. Uh... He could do 11 HP of damage, right? He's not at risk of dying if he misses. Or if it does. Uh... Let's get rid of this guy, I guess. Oh, he might have been the least of our concerns because he has such low accuracy. Uh, I kind of regret doing that. I probably should have done the other guys. Got a hand axe, though. It's an axe weapon. It's a weak throwing weapon. You just get to do axe damage from a distance. Put in the convoy. Who's got less accuracy? They both have the, the same character. Let's go for it. You doing this? Oh, of course it's 10 HP! Oh, thank you for missing! Thank you for missing. Oh my god, I was not prepared for that. No, oh, you can reach him! Okay, Noe, take this sucker out. Well, that turned out okay. All of them are gone now. Nothing left but the boss. Now I can finally rest easy a little bit. Unfortunately, lost a lot of allies on the way, but they'll be back with us after this fight. So hopefully, it won't all be in vain. Uh, keep Libra in front. Tharja. Can't quite reach that yet. Krom. God darn it. Could he make it all the way out here? Right there. Just wanted to get... Over to this. What have we here? Maybe I could use it for my hexes. Katarina's bolt! That's incredible. Oh, she can't use it? What? Okay, fine. I was good. I was wondering about that. I was like, maybe I should give that other tome to her, but she can't use it apparently. Switch to Robin. Wait here. Krom, this is your fight. Let's go. Uh, do I though? Mm, maybe I'll wait one more turn. Uh, go over here. It's all just racing to the boss now, trying to save Emreen. Uh, he could counter with magic. That's not good. Or it's not even with magic. Oh, you could take him out one hit. Mm -hmm. This is Krom's fight, though, so... I'll let this guy get weakened by Tharja first. You'll never save your precious exalt, scum!
Something I should mention about uh, Tharja, you might want to switch back and forth between her El Thunder and Nosferatu. Nosferatu not only does dark damage, but it also heals her. So not only is it incredibly powerful, but Tharja is also kind of like her own self healer, which is incredibly useful. But we only have 20 uses of it, so maybe we should just be sparing with it. But yeah, Krom, can you finish this guy off? Let's do this. Killing me will only feed Plesia's rage. Right. Robin, the Wyvern Riders have fallen. The skies are clear. I'm giving the signal. Your Grace. Philia. I'm so glad to see you're safe, but how? Right. Khan Basila's men freed me. Come, we must hurry. What? Pegasus Knights? How did they? That darn Elysian tactician does not play fair! <laughs> yes, well, neither do I. What? Risen? Oh gods, no! Krom! They are risen everywhere! What? No, not now! Oh, did an army of living corpses just appear out of the blue? Truly the heavens smile upon mighty Kring Grangle this day. Risen, ow, your grace, I, forgive me, Philia, oh, no. <laughs> one Pegasus night down, more to come, <laughs> watch how they fall one by one. No, no, no! Gods. We've lost! So close. I believe this is what they call a reversal of fortunes. Now, grovel before me. Plead! Beg for your worthless lives! I will not fail! I'd give up on my life before I beg from it for you! Huh? Now that is a good line! A fitting epitaph for your tombstone, perhaps? But it's not just your life in the balance. The Exalt still stands upon the block. And I have a dozen bows trained on her. All it would take is one word from me. Sister. Hold on! I'm... Oopsie. Archers, if this Elysian pops so much as twitches, let fly your arrows. I... I'll kill you! Go ahead! I welcome it! Just know you were responsible for Big Sister's bloody demise. And what of the rest of you, eh? Who wants the honor of killing the Exalt? No one? Bye, your merry band isn't quite so headstrong anymore, is it? Pathetic. Damn you. Back for your life! Now, now, my boy. No one needs to die today. Not you. Not the Exalt. Not your friend. Just lay down your sword and give me the fire emblem. I... Krom. You can't trust him! Still. Uh, of course I can't trust him! I'm not an idiot! But if I just say no, he'll kill her! The gods are cruel, darn them! My sister or my duty, a problem with no right answer, yet I must choose! Throughout all of history, within this universe, darkness always seemed to have the upper hand. Even though our situation seems incredibly hopeless. And sacrificing the Fire Emblem might be 
the exact thing that would bring this world to ruin. We can't sacrifice Emerine's life. But if we save her now, we're going to have to hope that we could come back from this and reclaim the Fire Emblem from its evil clutches. There's no good way out of this war. It's now just a matter of who we want to save and who we could save later. But right now, we have to save Emreen. That's right. Don't give up. There has to be a way. If there is, I can't see it. Oh, gods! I will count to three. Throw down your weapons or your exalt becomes the world's largest quiver. One, two, the Grango, hold. You win. Everyone, lay down your... Enough. Silence! Sister. King Grangle. Is there no hope you will listen to reason? You mean listen to more of your sanctimonious babble? I think not. No, all I want to hear now is the thunk of arrows and a splat as you hit the ground. Take one long last look from your perch. You do so enjoy looking down on people. Then prepare to meet the ground and your maker. That is, unless someone were to give me the emblem. Now! Wait! Alright! Alright, Em, I know you won't approve, but this is my final decision. Maybe someday we'll face a crisis where maybe the emblem would have helped. But I know for a fact that Ulysses needs you today! The people need their exalt! And we need our sister. If those dark days should come, We'll face them together. Krum. Thank you. I now know what I must do. Em, what are you? <laughs> Plesians, I ask that you hear the truth of my words. War will win you nothing but sadness and pain, both inside your borders and out. Free yourselves from this hatred, from this cycle of pain and vengeance. Do what you must. As I will do. See now that one selfless act has the power to change the world. Sister! No! How dare you, Grangle? No! Well now, how disgustingly noble. 
and so lovely a fall. Here I thought death to be an ugly thing. I've never seen one fall so gracefully, in fact, and I've seen many fall. Ah, so ends Emery, Ulysses most exalted. But how can we ensure everyone remembers this beautiful moment of her sacrifice? Perhaps we should gather up her body and put it on display! <laughs> Grangle, you die today! Go. No, boy! I secured an escape room. We have to flee. But her body, I have to! Help. You have to run! Now do it! Robin, don't let him do anything stupid! No. Oh gods, no! I'm too late! Our bleak future is written once more. And darkness awaits us all. <laughs>